Uh, hey guys, it's me, the Twilight Shimmer, and today I'm gonna be doing one of those uh, product uh, product uh, reviews that I usually do on my channel, like you know, like a before with toys and whatnot. But this time, uh, I'll be doing one with a very uh similar pro similar product that I did before, like you know, like a few weeks ago maybe in April. So yeah, let me just. Oh, over here quickly. Uh, so, uh, so today I'll be talking about my uh, Queen Chrysalis, Queen Chrysalis, sorry, uh, plush that I uh, uh, previously ordered from eBay back in. I think it was back in. I think it was back like at the end of uh, April time. I, I did so. So yeah, here's my Queen Chrysalis. Sorry, Queen Chrysalis Pr Plushie. Oh, God. So I can't say his name properly for some reason. I can't say her name properly for some reason. But yeah, uh, here she is. Uh, she's basically one of the villains in the show, and 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 she's basically and uh, and she's known as a changeling. So in in so in French is magic. Changelings are like uh, creatures that are able to uh, change their appearance. So she could transform into like a hammer or whatnot, or 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 a pony, in a sense, and um, and she was the uh, and she was the um, and she was the queen of the uh, changelings until season six finale when uh, when oh when uh, when I have to, I try to remember now like what's the name Forax, a good changeling decided to uh, basically like uh, basically like um. Uh, what's the word like a rebel against her, and uh, you know, and you know, and you know, instead of like sharing kindness, you know, like not share but kind of like take kindness away from others, he shared it with others. Like you know, like he basically shared it with the other changelings, and they were like, oh, okay, uh, if he can do that, we can do that too. Uh, but she's the only changeling who doesn't change. <laughs> You see what I did there, because you know, changing. But anyways, and um, and she's still around after season six, but uh, but she doesn't actually make her appearance again until like season eight in one episode called what was it called? Uh, the uh, the mean six, where she basically cl uh, clones her own, basically like makes her own evil clones of the main six called the mean six, and you know, and tries to get them to steal the elements of the elements of harmony, but but. It, and, but then it doesn't work because they basically like a rebel against her, and she decides to kill them off. And then, and then after that, in in season nine, like this is where she finally returns fully. But here's the thing about season nine: it's it's pretty bad in my opinion, because what happens is, uh, she, Cozy Glow, and Tyrick uh, are basically are basically forced to work together by this villain named like Grogar, who is um who is um a Discord. In disguise, uh, but yeah, guys, like that's basically like uh, uh, you know, like Queen Queen Chrysalis in, in general. She's just if she's a villain, if she's a villain, who, she's a villain who doesn't really like change. And and in her first episode, uh, a, a first appearance in the show in season in season two, uh, the Royal Cantalot Wedding, she basically. Uh, kidnaps Princess K Princess Cadence, and uh, and impersonates her to steal Shine Armor's love and whatnot, and take over Cancel as well. Uh, but thanks to their love, I guess, uh, the love of uh, you know Cadence and Shine Armor, they manage to uh, like you know like send all like send all the send all the changes back into whatnot. Oh, but yeah, guys. Like this is my. Uh, oh, but yeah, guys. This was basically my product, like product, a review of, uh, like Queen Chrysalis. Uh, not bad, not bad. But the only, the problem is like the wings. I kind of have a problem because I kind of want them to be a bit bigger, in my opinion. But you know, I guess I guess this is like show accurate. And the best you can do with these wings is just like fold them like this, I guess. Uh,
And before I go, I, I just wanted to show you guys the other mic that I got pre previously. Stay, Chris, stay. Oh, thank you. Uh, and so here's the mic I got recently. Uh, what you do is like you just open this up. And, and and you speak into it like this, but the thing is, right? So um, uh, the problem is, right? Because I put it down on the table, I have to like, I have to like lean in, I have to lean in and talk to it. It's it's the reason why it's the reason why I talk differently on cameras because I have to speak into this thing, like you know, like all the time, and it and also comes with this as well. Like for laptop users, yeah, so if you're a laptop user, you can basically just basically you you, you basically like plug the uh, like plug the mic into this, and, and you can like and just, and you can also plug your like you know headphone or whatnot into here as well. No, yeah, which is good because the last one was like when I first got this, I was a bit worried that I wouldn't be able to use it in my laptop, but but now I can without worries. But if you're a PC user, you can just you know like. You like you don't really like need this for PC really because you can just plug this like you know into the back of your uh, computer. Uh, but anyways, guys, like that was and that's the end of my uh, product review. Uh, I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Sorry. Oh, God damn it. Okay. Uh. Bye.